Well. Welcome back. How yeah. was it? Um, you know, it was uh, a little bit difficult. I gotta be honest with you. The socks were the hardest part, and uh, I wouldn't suggest doing that at, at your house. But you did it. I, I, I did, I did do it. Like you said you could. That is true, that is true. All right, do I get to read a letter now? Absolutely. Awesome, I'm gonna take the one that's right in front of me right here, and let's Perfect. see. It says, my hands are a little wet, sorry. <laughs> it says, it's from Trevor, and Trevor's in the second grade. It says, Dear Zone, my friend told me that she's getting baptized next Sunday at her church. Aww. That's awesome. What is baptism? Well, Trevor, I'm glad you asked. That's a very good question, and hang on. Hang on, I'm, we're hearing. We're hearing from producers. There are little earpieces here. You can't see them, but they definitely exist. And they're saying that Pastor Jonathan has indeed made it to the beach. Yes. And he is ready to take this question on himself. Are you ready, boys and girls? Are you ready, Miss Alex? I'm ready. Pastor Jonathan, take it away. What's up, boys and girls? Welcome to the beach. I'm Pastor Jonathan. And can you do me a favor? Can you turn to your neighbor and say, did you bring the suntan lotion? Okay. Uh, no, nobody brought the suntan lotion. You guys are all gonna get sunburned. I'm so sorry, the sun's gonna come through the screen, uh, but there's nothing I can do about that. Hey, this series is all about diving in to new life. Right? And so I think the best question anybody could ask about baptism is, what is it? So go ahead and just turn to those people next to you again and just say, excuse me, excuse me, tap them on the shoulder. What is baptism? Okay, everybody's asked that question? Great question, I'm gonna answer it. Now, baptism is the next step. Now, I want you to say next step and stomp your foot as hard as you can on the count of three. Ready, one, two, three, next step! Great, great, that was awesome. It's the next step you take after you decide in your heart to believe in Jesus. Now, after you get baptized, boys and girls, that's where the really good stuff starts. I mean, God starts to do these amazing things in you and through you. He starts to write this amazing story in your life. But even though it's an important next step, it's a step only you can choose to take. Now, while you're thinking about that, think about this. You put one leg of your pants on and start walking around without putting on the other leg. Imagine you put one flipper on and forget the other one and start walking on the beach. Imagine you take your favorite inflatable pool toy to the beach, but you forget to inflate it. As you can see, I mean, the next step is really important. Like without it, what is the point? I mean, like going halfway just to turn around makes about as much sense as tying your shoes underwater. Sorry, no offense, Mr. Will. That's why baptism is so important, boys and girls. It's saying goodbye to the old life and Hello to the new life. Now, I want you to do me a favor. I want you to imagine that you're this guy. Not Aquaman, this is Moses. You're Moses, okay? Point to yourself and say, I'm Moses. Yeah, you are. And now, God has chosen you to deliver his people, the Israelites, out of Egypt. They were slaves there, and with the power of God, you helped them escape. Good job, you. Now, you're on your way to an amazing place that God has prepared just for you. It's called the promised land. Woo, promised land, oh yeah! But, there's always a but. I'm sorry, there's a big but here. Moses and the Israelites, in order to get to the promised land, they have to cross a giant body of water called the Red Sea. Now, remember, you're Moses. What do you do? Raise your left hand if you say, okay, I guess we're turning back, guys. It's easier to be a slave in Egypt than to step into a giant body of water that's gonna kill us. Raise your left hand, uh-huh, uh-huh, that's what you do. Okay, now, now, raise your right hand if you would step into that body of water. You would take that next step if God told you to, even if it was into a giant body of water. Raise your right hand, go ahead, go ahead. I like what I'm seeing. Now, for those of you who are adventurous out there, I have good news for you. Moses and the Israelites, they did take that next step and God showed up in a huge way. He pulled back that water like a curtain, and Moses and the Israelites, they walked right through. I mean, essentially, boys and girls, they got baptized. They stepped out of their old life, through the water, and into the new life that God had for them. Now, let's talk about your choice. Baptism is your choice to do exactly what Moses and the Israelites did. 
to say goodbye to their old life, no looking back, to take that next step and say new life is my future with Jesus. It's a choice only you can make. And you may be thinking, well, am I ready to make that choice? Am I ready to dive into new life? I want to pray with you and ask God. We can talk to God together and ask him to help us to know when the right time is. So repeat after me, boys and girls. God, thank you for your son, Jesus. Thank you that he died and rose again to give me new life. Help me to understand that new life and to make my own decision to be baptized. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks so much, boys and girls, for coming out here and hanging out at the beach with me. As for now, I'm going to go take a dive of my own. See you next time. Pastor Jonathan, thank you so much for that. Love it. All right, Mr. Will, it's time to wrap this thing up. Oh, how, how, do, we, how do we wrap this thing up? Well, we are going to do our big idea, but to Ooh. do it, we're going to stand this time. Oh, okay. But we got to push back. Oh, okay. This, oh, that's... Yep. Well, that, that, was too, that, was too, that was too hard. I'll try better next time. Okay. Okay. Okay, here we go. All right, boys and girls, up on your feet. Do our new big idea with us. Here we go. Here we go. Let me see you. Let me see you. Let me see you. You back there? I see you. Okay. I see you. Here we, go. Ready. here we go. All right. On the count of three. One, two, three. Dive, Dive in to new, new life. life. That was better than the first time. I think so. I, good. I, we are getting oh. better. And now you gotta swim back. Oh, swim back? I mean, this is what I always do. Oh, this is fun. Yeah, and this it's is good because it's dive, I you like know? it, yeah, this was very fun. Hey, what? my first Zone TV in the books, thank you for showing me the ropes. Hey, you know what? You did good. Thanks so much. You did good.